Everybody. Oh my god. It's an echo. I heard oh. it. Let me see. Maybe it was I think it's gone. Okay. Okay. Um okay. when I tell you it's been a Tasha Field K morning. Oh my that's how we've been talking about, it, isn't it? <laughs> Tasha Field K. <laughs> it's a Tasha K Field morning. Tons of um I'm calling attorneys. I just got through talking to uh Dennis Byron, the guy that was in the uh, oh. courtroom every sin single day that did an Hip -hop amazing- Hip-Hop Inquirer, right? Pardon me? What's his channel? Hip-Hop Inquirer? Or something yeah, like that? the Hip-Hop Inquirer. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, sorry. Oh. I ain't mean to cut you off. <laughs> they said you you take me out of, never mind. Go ahead. What were you gonna say, Perry? <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. I was just saying that this, I was making sure it was the same person that I watched. That's yeah. the name of the channel. Okay, yeah. Um. And yeah, so it's been a crazy morning. So a lot's been going on. Um, people are saying, okay, so we know she was found guilty. Cardi B came out and made a statement. <sighs> okay, this is crazy. Tasha K attorneys made a statement. Tasha's been tweeting. This is, <sighs> she needs to leave it alone. I Right now, Tasha, leave, leave it alone. Just leave it alone. Uh, Tasha, um, Tasha Kay's attorney said, we disagree with the verdict and we will be filing an appeal. So what I'm told about this, this is a process. The appeal has to be accepted. So right now you're still guilty. People say, don't use that word, say liable. No, guilty, guilty, guilty. That's what I say. <laughs> okay. You're still guilty right now. And um, also people were saying with that on top of the taxes, at the end of the day, it could all probably come out to $5 million. This is not a joke. Like, this is not a joke. Cardi B, on the other hand, came out and she said, she, to me, she seemed um, sincere, uh, relieved, and humble. So, also, someone's saying that she asked for a light sentence. I don't know where that came from. I checked. I talked to people <laughs> that were in the courtroom. Why are we laughing? <laughs> you said, wait, a life sentence? A light. Light. Oh, light. Oh, yeah. I thought you said life as an L-I-F-E. I'm sorry. <laughs> like, that's a little much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see. I see. Uh, and and ahead, ready to talk. I mean, because with that, though, I heard the same thing, too. Like, you know, rumblings in the morning, but I was watching the... Uh, the lead attorney and I was watching what it was. It wasn't for all three counts. It was for the medical part. Mm. And Cardi B agreed to it because they awarded her two hundred and fifty thousand, but oh, Cardi only took twenty five thousand. Oh, that was so, nice, uh huh? That's okay. That's that's yeah, different. I I thought somebody was saying uh, out there. People were saying that she asked for a light sentence, and I said that doesn't make sense. You don't sue anybody and then ask for a light. You know, not don't make it three point eight. Right, Let's it. make it two. No, I, yeah. That didn't make sense. So now we clarify that. <laughs> okay, so this is what Cardi uh, said. Uh, After almost four years of repeated libel and slander against me, being able to walk away from this victorious brings me great happiness. Oh, uh, she, she was very humble when she said this. I can't read it the way that she said it. During this trial, all of you have learned about the darkest time of my life. She's calling it the darkest time in her life. It, we'll get to that in a minute. That moment in time was fueled by the vile, disgusting, and completely false narratives that were repeatedly and relentlessly being shared online. I thought I would never be heard or vindicated, and I felt completely helpless and vulnerable. Oof. I have never taken for granted the platform that my fame allows me to have, which is why for over three years, I have dedicated every resource I had to seek justice and not just justice for me. The truth is that the intentional harm that was done to me is done to countless others every day. The only difference between me and the higher schooler who is being cyberbullied and lied on by their classmates 
is the money and resources I have access to. I have collectively have to say enough is enough. Well, mm, that was powerful to me because <laughs> she didn't gloat. She didn't talk trash back. She talked about what this did to her. And she could have had, she had several points in there. If she didn't have the money and resources, people could have yeah. believed this story. Mm -hmm. She's right about that. And people realize, don't understand that just because you're a celebrity doesn't mean people are allowed to treat you any kind of way, mess up your reputation. They become more vulnerable. Mm -hmm. right. Hi, Stephanie. Let's see what Stephanie said. Oh, no. I just saw my phone's been on silent all day. I'm so sorry I missed your call, Sherelle. I got you next time. Thank you. Oh, is Stephanie uh, an attorney? AT2? Yes, she is. Oh, my God, Stephanie. Well, if you're ready, if call in. Let me drop this link really quickly. Yes, yeah, Stephanie um, is. She's awesome. Yeah, let me see if she can call in. I mean, let's just, so yesterday we all talked about Tasha K. Tasha K, why she did what she did, and Tasha K from her point of view. But there's another side here, and that is Cardi. Cardi B. Right. Do you remember yesterday, Sherelle, I said that Cardi B is representing all of those people, whether it's a celebrity or whatever, that has been harmed in this particular way. And that's why I said that, you know, unfortunately, Tasha K was on the lower end of the stick in this particular situation. And that's why another reason why she should have never just went into it, because most people are going to be able to relate to the story that Cardi B is telling, you know, a story of being bullied, a story of, you know, being someone doing you wrong or doing you dirty. Mm -hmm. So they can relate to that. And so that alone is going to help her win this case. But like you said, very humble in her statement. I felt it was humble. Also, I talked to an attorney. Uh, Emily Baker covered the case and a couple others. Uh, one of my favorite is the lead attorney. I'm going to see if I can get him on the show. I really like him. Uh, bankruptcy appears to not is not going to help the situation because mm. it was a personal lawsuit. OK, so it was personal. Also, I'm being told. Uh, a judge has to approve uh, a bankruptcy and things like that. And even if she can't pay, Cardi B will get what they call a judgment against her, which means that whenever she can go other ways for the money, if you can't pay me, I could go after your, your earnings on your YouTube channel. This is serious. Uh, I could yeah. file a lien against you. You know, they can come after other assets that could, uh, that will, Cover property. the property. What, what am lien. I saying? Pay, pay Pro it off. Property lien. Yeah. yeah. Property. Uh, it could be a property lien. Property lien. This is a real judgment. It's serious. And then also they're talking about that the taxes not being paid is serious. Mm. So, and a lot of people are saying she needs her channel closed down. I said this yesterday. I said this this morning. I wonder what your thoughts are on this diva and AT2 because. V and Perry have already stated theirs. <laughs> yeah, because like I said, though, like I stated my opinion yesterday, but I've been watching a lot of channels and stuff, like I said. And what people are actually saying right now, and I sort of get it. It's like, well, if if she violated the YouTube uh, terms, the YouTube community rules, and other channels has been taken down for less. Mm -hmm. Now, we all know YouTube can override it. I mean, they pick and choose who they want right. to get rid of. But I think it could set them up for a problem if, if, say, they let it go and then they discipline somebody else's channel next week for the same thing. Could it be recourse for that person saying, hey, because she got a federal judge. I, I want I want to say this really quick before I let you guys keep talking. Uh, Philly girl says Tasha is still talking crap on her ch page. It's the damnedest thing. 
Yeah. I know she's going uh, live tomorrow. I think at 7 p.m. Eastern time, yeah. she's going live tomorrow to address everything. And this is going to be her one-time statement. But um, regarding her channel, uh, no, I don't think she should lose her channel. Because one thing, um, she makes money off of the channel. And so she needs some way to pay Cardi B. Like, yes, she has her website and stuff like that. But she needs some way to pay Cardi B. So I don't think her channel should get taken down. Um, I think it, it kind of... Uh, let's all of us content creators know that we need to be more careful in what we say and how we present something. Um, you know, we have to say like, this is what we heard, or, you know, this is our source. We just can't say like, this is fact. Um, I think that's a one important thing to remember about this case. Um, it was basically stated that this information about Cardi was fact. Mm -hmm. And yeah. when you have somebody saying that this is fact, then it's all like, whoa, no, like this ain't fact, you know, like, because, from content we're all content creators up here well besides me but we're all content creators up here and so we understand that there's entertainment value and stuff like that so we get it but some people when they hear us say something they're all like oh that gotta be true that that's gotta be it you know and if we don't uh, necessarily say like this is a rumor allegedly this is what we heard and we're saying like this is fact then that's where you know the line gets uh crossed you know Bro, now, you know, you know that at too, because that exactly t same thing happened to you. Right, you know, I know that, from experience. That, so. Yeah, so <laughs> I'm saying uh, that line is very thin, and it's very easy to cross because people start talking and saying stuff as if it was facts, as if they right. knew it to be facts. V, I wanted to talk specifically to you. These super chats are rolling in really quickly. Thank you, NK Universe. This whole Tasha K reminds me of the old saying, a hardest head makes for a soft behind. I missed another one here. Uh, I will support uh, bad. I will never yeah. support bad behavior, black or not. Tasha screwed up. The piper must be paid. Get the money, pay the lady, and do better. Mm. Oh my. Oh I want to talk to you, V, specifically, <laughs> because you're what I refer to as a Tasha sympathizer. Yeah. <laughs> and, <laughs> and you you are a tasha sympathizer yeah <laughs> you do admit she's in deep trouble there's no getting out of this right i admit she's in deep trouble i i also think she was probably the first person to be caught doing what she's doing that there was other content creators at some point that's made up stories mm -hmm. whose name i shall not mentioned that made up stories about people mm -hmm. that didn't show their face. Oh, <laughs> oh <right>. shots fired. <laughs> <laughs> I, had to go, I had to hide off camera for you. I know who she was talking about. Shots fired, shots fired. Hold on, V, let me read this really quick. Thanks okay. for the clarification. The lead attorney had a bankruptcy attorney on, and he said Tasha K could file and have a lot more, lot of the monies owed discharge. I don't think they're going to prove that. But we'll not. see. I don't think um, so. well, let V finish. I cut her off. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. Go ahead, V. So, so I'm saying uh, a lesson learned here, uh, but it, you know, there's always that first person that that gets caught doing something they shouldn't be doing, and so. Uh, Everybody then is saying, oh, my gosh, she should have her channel taken down. This, that, and this. I think she, what she did was wrong. I think she uh, probably will learn from this and uh, should not have her channel taken down because that's her income. And, you know, just because you do something wrong, maybe she can start here, start again and, and understand what, what she should and shouldn't do and just keep going strong. Just because you do something right. wrong, I don't think people should. And people like to do this a lot, jump on the van wagon and just wipe somebody out down to their knees. And I just don't think that should happen. What, no, what do it. you think? Oh, go ahead, Perry. Sorry. No, I'm saying I, I get what V's saying. Like, nobody's wishing nobody's channel get knocked down anywhere. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's right. a livelihood. It's your job, your career, whatever, right? But at the same time, for people, speaking for the people who channel has been removed, Right. For this less, what would you say about that, B? People, this channel has been removed from less. Got, got, uh, really got the bad, bad end of the stick, because 
No one should lose their channel for, I mean, if this, as bad as it is, I don't think she should lose her channel. I don't think anybody should lose their channel if it's their source of income. But le lessons should be learned from doing that kind of stuff. And consequences may be paid for doing that kind of stuff. But I don't think you should lose your, your a source of income. And usually well, people are warned too before they lose their channel. Well, no, no, not nosy. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Some people yeah. are not warned, right? Because I okay. can understand what, what everybody's saying too. Like, and, and like the whole thing is this. Because I feel like this. I don't think she should personally. Like, I'm just saying outside the YouTube terms and community. I don't think she should lose because I feel like she's already been punished with the financial fee of paying those right. legal fees right. Right. and yeah. things like that. So I feel like that's double punishment. Right. Uh, so, go ahead, Diva. <laughs> okay. So here's the thing. If you work for the bank and you rob the bank, you need to pay the money back and get fired. <laughs> so the problem here is she did something and what she did, our personal feelings as a personal person, I don't want to see her lose her platform that has been built up to a million subscribers. But on a real reason, and we got to look at this as it is, if you're still tweeting and wilding out, did you learn anything? Absolutely not, in let's, my opinion. Let's talk about her still talking crap, Diva. Whoa. Right. You, you, you're still talking crap. What lesson did you learn? When do you humble yourself? When do you bow down? I would have bowed down the minute I was really in court and said, okay, hold up, hold up. Can we do a mediation? I yeah. give up. Mercy. I would have pleaded insanity. I mean, I would have fainted. I would have fainted. Right. So here's the thing. On Same. a personal level, yes, I don't think I'm not I'm not going to be rooting and rah rah to see her channel come down. But let's do facts here. You did something wrong. You don't seem to be showing any remorse. And there were other people. What this one case is representing a lot of other people that did not have the money to speak up to fight mm. for them. Mm. There were some right. other people that she had tore down the ground zero, and they lost their income and their livelihood as a result of things that she has said in the videos that she has made on her channel. Now they, 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 they penniless. So, and one, when one person is that relationship guru, now was he wrong, but she dragged him all the way to the bottom where now he's not making the money and doesn't have the platform that he used to have. So my thing is you have done it to others. And in this case, you was given 17 chances to mm. turn the situation around mm. and not be at this point right now. So you're wasting more money, like I said the other day, than you would have than you would have lost by taking the videos down, right? You're going to do a right. appeal. That's money to your lawyers again, and uh, you already lost. V, you got to push but, back. She but, is yeah, still because, talking trash. How do you defend that? Because people want to see people broken. They want to see you come out in public and look broken and depressed and sad that this happened to me. I mean. Things happen to people every day. Stand up and be strong. Make life go on. You ain't got to show the whole world that you broke it. You know, so maybe that's where she is right now. Right. She might be just saying one thing. But, but the V else. wasn't Cardi B broken? Cardi Come B on. is broken and also has broke people. This is Ooh. Cardi B. Ooh. She is no angel. Ooh. Ooh. Right, right. She's, 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 no, she's so no angel. Everybody, right? act, everybody acting like Cardi B got wings now. The no, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Listen to me. Here's the thing. She has done some stuff, right? And she yes. has said some stuff. But right. what we got to understand is the level of which Tasha had done to her personally. Party B has generalized some stuff, right? So, mm -hmm. and this stuff is in the past. And it, yes, your past resurfaced. But what we're talking about right now is you making video after video after video telling about what's going on in my private part, okay? What I done stole my body for and did, okay? What I did the other man. Then you bring some chick on there that you know is lying. It's so many problematic things in this. You bring this chick on your platform that you know is lying. But now if you present that chick to your followers, right? They're going to believe, well, dad, this girl is saying that she lived here. She she lived with her. So this must be true. So everybody is not taking everything Tasha says as entertainment. Some people are taking it as truth. And there are other bloggers 
they not speaking up now. They kind of hide it. There's other bloggers when she was telling that story, they made a story about that story yeah, and they yeah. carried it on also. So the story had right. legs because other one. people was doing it too. B, other people, what? Other people? I know you're a Tasha supporter, but how do you explain? You say everybody did something wrong in their past. You say, well, Cardi's no angel too, but we're not talking about her past. We're talking about a specific case. I mean, how many people do you think is out there that, that wanted to take her to court, to take Cardi to court, and, and just could not afford it? To me, in this situation, the money is speaking. The money is speaking because she was able to take that situation that happened to her and had enough money to see it all the way through. Not everybody, and she's done some things to people before that probably could have went to court, but not everybody has that kind of money. So a lot of people suffered in the silence because of some things she did to them. You know what? This no. heart of inspiration, though, this heart of inspiration, call it. I forgot I about know, the I love you inspiration. Okay, uh, she says, Diva is telling the truth. Not, let's not act like Tasha didn't interview Jaguar's autistic child, yeah. adult child, for clicks and views. Does this, does that mean the, because everybody want to dig into people's past now. Mm -hmm. Why can't we talk about the specific accusations you are not okay you don't believe in the cancel culture but what if you did something so bad let me take it off v give me a minute eric what if you did something so bad <laughs> that you deserve to be canceled we're just having a conversation well no not get it no no i mean i get what you're saying but look look let me say this and i sort of understand what v saying i think we all in this thing nobody want to see a person damaged and lose their channel mm -hmm. but sometimes it's recourses to our actions mm -hmm. but I will say this. Sometimes I might get on here and say something. I ain't really meaning it or whatever. But if a person send me something direct and says, cease and desist, I got time to re-examine what the hell I just said. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I can make a choice, but mm -hmm. I can also come back the next day and, and double down. Mm -hmm. And wipe your butt with the cease and desist. Right. I That's will say, I'm starting to see it's a difference. But go ahead. I will say this, and this is not on a Cardi B level. I have had people, oh, AT2, you too. We've had people make up blatant lies on us. Right. Just blatant lies, and people took it and ran with it and as mm -hmm. if it was true. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That is a bad situation to be in. What do you say to those people, V, that like you're just lying on me? Right. For clicks and views. Yeah, I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that. That I, I agree with that kind of stuff. You know, that people should make up stuff and lie on other people. I'm totally against that because I just said ATT is an example of that happening to him. A totally right. innocent person got dragged through the mud for a lot of people uh, talking about stuff that wasn't true. I'm not right. saying that, but I'm saying in this particular case, she she won, but everybody is acting like. She she won because she there was no fault in her. She won because she had enough money to win, not well, because it was. No, there well, was what no did fault. Cardi B she that had she, she had videos, B. She had video evidence. Right, and right. She, yeah. uh, what did what did Cardi B? What do you mean she she uh, there was fault in her? Of course, we know in her personal life she talks trash stuff like that. But what did she do in this case to deserve right. this treatment? Right, right. But this in this case she she got caught. I mean she 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 was uh, drug drug in this case. So we put it that way. She was drug in this case, and she deserved to to get uh, her victory for that because that did happen to her, and she deserved her victory for that. So I'm not saying that she shouldn't uh, be punished for what she did, uh, or shouldn't be have a victory for what she what happened to her because what happened to her was wrong i'm just saying people are acting like that this is the holy grail like this yeah. is the wor worst thing that has happened on the internet and uh, uh cardi b is the angel and she yeah. you know she shouldn't have had all this stuff done to her and she shouldn't you know that's true she should not have but there's a lot of people out there that she's done things to, too, also, that didn't get a chance to speak up and have her put on court, so to speak, put on trial, so to speak, because they didn't have the money to see it through like she did.
Right. I think I gave it to me because she was able to afford it. Right. But V, to much is given, much is required. Right. So, Tasha, you have this platform. You have a million followers. You have some sense of responsibility, right, Mm -hmm. to do right on your platform. Now, we all like the entertainment. We want to be entertained. That's why we watch our favorite YouTubers so that we could be entertained and see it. But when you're taking it over the top, when you're crossing the line, when you begin to only care about how many likes you get and how much money you're making, that's when it goes wrong. That's when things go away. So find that she would have made maybe one video and had this girl up there and said what she said. But she got relentless. She wouldn't let up. You can't get three cease and desist and then you still don't stop that's where your arrogance kicked in so now look at where your arrogance led you it led you in court right it led you in court and now you're going to have to pay out possibly four million dollars is it worth it and that's her punishment she should in, in addition to that also, that's what I'm saying. She shouldn't have to be broken down to nothing. She shouldn't, in addition to that, also have to lose her channel, lose her income, lose her uh, any means of making money. You know, enough is, you know, people want to go too far with stuff. She sh- should pay for what she did. What she did was wrong. I'm not not doubting that at all. What she did was wrong. She should pay for what she did. But she shouldn't have to be broken over it. And that's what I think people want to see. They want to see somebody all the way broke down before they feel like they've been vindicated. Yeah, I think where V is coming from, because you see a lot of people, and let's be honest, as YouTubers, we all got people that come after us. But I think what from V standpoint, a uh, point that she was getting to was that um, a lot of people are relishing that this has happened to Tasha because they right. don't like her personally. And so everybody's on the train of like, yeah, take her channel, take her channel. But it's all like, OK, well, if this was someone you like, would you have wanted their channel to I be don't taken? Know, AT2, because when you no. were done on fairly by John Yates, I right, felt right. your pain. Right, I, right. I mean, let's start taking calls. Let's see what the audience is. Anybody got anything to say before I start taking calls? Well, I will okay. say this, Sherelle, again. If I rob the bank, right, <laughs> should I just have to pay them back and then I could go back and work at the bank as a teller again so I could rob them again and again and again and again? So we're going to leave her on the platform. And mm-hmm. granted, I don't want to see her channel taken now, but we're going to leave her on the platform so she can go lie on somebody again and make mm-hmm. some more videos. Did the videos, are the videos still up there? Are the Cardi B videos still on her channel? I just looked. Yes. Oh, see, that's a problem. Oh, okay. And, 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 right. That's what I was going to say. Who's going to start the calls? GoFundMe to help Tasha with her legal fees? Who's going to help with the GoFundMe? <laughs> yeah. well, you know, we need to donate a dollar. So. up. But go ahead, Perry, first for taking calls. No, no, no. I was just going to say this. Uh, that's the whole thing. It's like, at a, at a point, I don't want nobody's channel taken down. But we all, uh, as adults, got to take accountability. At least if somebody brought it to your attention, you get rid of the cease and desist. But when the judge order you liable, at what point are you going to just take the videos down? Or is it still the greed? If it's up, because now her name's out there, it gets more views. Right. Mm. It raised her stock. It, it did. No matter what happened to Tasha, it raised her stock. Like yeah. there's publications publishing her name, like billboards and all these different, um, you know, like websites and stuff like that. It raised her stock. And so now Tasha looking like, oh, I'm the shit. Like this makes me legit because my name is everywhere. Even though Tasha it's bad, has got my to name. Stop. She has <laughs> got to stop at some point. I can't believe she's still talking trash on Instagram. Oh, this is nothing. Four million dollars. Let's start taking calls. Yeah, this is crazy. Four dollars uh, and I would up. Hi, Sherelle. Hi, gang. So, hi. Oh, hi. This is this crazy, Sherelle? This morning, <laughs> V. By the way, I love you, but no, 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 no. This morning, <laughs> I went to. I, I actually came on YouTube and and looked up the um the the video, still and it. it was still up. Yes. And 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 I watched it, you know, thinking back to um, um, having listened to all, everything that was being discussed yesterday as mm-hmm. the news was breaking on your on your channel, Cheryl. Mm-hmm. And and three things came to mind. The first thing was race being used as an excuse for somebody doing something yeah. wrong, 
is offensive to me because there are many, many legitimate issues that we can count. For example, Bravo and what's her name this, this week using um, language that is not only offensive, but for most of us has a history of pain and suffering. Someone saying we should not be questioning um, um, Tasha K because Cardi B has a history of um, saying certain things about women. That is, that is as, as they say, apples and oranges. Secondly, this was in federal court. This is a judge and a jury that listened to testimony from Cardi's lawyers and testimony from Tasha K, her husband, and whatever witnesses they had to talk on her behalf. And then it was decided when, when a judge says, okay, um, you are not only liable, but you have to pay court costs for the other person. They are really trying to let you know that what you did was wrong. And the other thing is once a federal judgment is, is made against you, lawyers call it what they call, um, it becomes settled law which puts everybody else on notice that um, if you go out and you say this, you have freedom of speech, but freedom of speech does not protect you from consequences. Mm -hmm. And lastly, YouTube has every right to make whatever decision they make concerning Tasha's um, um, channel, irrespective of her followers. Case in point, who was taken off Twitter for spreading lies, bigotry, and hatred? Our former president. How many followers did he have? He had millions. But because... Uh, wait, hold on, Bobby, Bobby. Are you saying if they can kick off the president, they can kick <laughs> off Tasha? <laughs> Without a doubt, because these are private companies. She, yeah. she, she, she doesn't um, own stock on YouTube. Where she, she can getting her mic? Say, I know. Bonji, you're having mic troubles. Um, did you was there anything else you wanted to say? Because it's hurting the uh chat's ears. <laughs> no, I made my point. I'll get off. Thanks. But Zia, Thanks, that's Bonji. what you're wrong, sister. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Bye, Bonji. Bonji. I still love you. Bye, Bonji. Bye. But um, I wanted to say something. Um, a lot of people were bringing in race and they're saying, Oh, Tasha K is a black woman, and then this is why this stuff is happening. It has nothing to do with black, white, or whatever. This was a situation where Tasha was worn and she kept going and going and going. That's totally different. Nothing about race. Mm -hmm. All right, right. Let me get some more. Uh, personally, I don't think people want to see her broken. However, when she, when does she take accountability for her actions? Maybe losing her channel might be a start. People want that channel down, V. I know. It seems uh, like they want that channel down. Lisa, can you sound off really quickly? Because I want to take a lot of calls today. Yeah, I am too. One of the, this is one of the things you got to be careful what you say on your channel. I promise mm -hmm. you, when I had started my channel, my mentor had told me, Lisa, be careful what you say because you can't get sued. Mm -hmm. And I remember you say leisurely all the time, leisurely, because that's why when the women you see on her show all the time, uh, leisurely, because you don't want to get sued. Mm -hmm. right. And plus on this platform, I used to, this, my mentor, the one who told me about talk to her, and I used to listen to her all the time. But some of the stuff she was saying I didn't agree with, but this is the this is the fact you're going with. You cannot be bullying people, bullying people. Now, do I think she need to take her platform down? No, I do not. But they need to uh, YouTube need to contact her and tell her to take those videos down, though. Yeah, I can't believe yeah, she's never before. I yeah. think they should make her take those videos down too. You know I agree with that. So, yeah. Yeah. She should have just took them down. Yeah, she should have, but I think, but now she, I don't think she's going to do it now she's been liable. But you two ought to step in right now and say, hold up, take those videos down, or you can not be plotting our platform no more. Yeah. That is the right. problem. Yeah. She probably she said she paid $4 million for them videos. <laughs> yeah, yeah, she sure did, but she going to pay $4 million. Yeah, I hope it's worth it. Have, that's why you see, that's why Cheryl got it on the bottom. This is allegedly our opinions. <laughs> that's it. See, Perry, Cheryl got, uh, got smart. 
<laughs> you, know like, you have to say allegedly. You got to say happen. allegedly. You got to say allegedly. You got to listen to Wendy Williams, baby. Doc. She might not be on TV now, baby. Doc, but she did say it in the past. You got to say allegedly, okay? So that's all I want to say. You have a beautiful evening. Hi, Diva. I love you. Yeah. Hey, you too. I mean, hey, uh, A2. Hey, I love you. Too. Hey, hey, Lisa. Lisa. All right, take care. Thank, Thank you so much. Bye, Lisa. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna like a, lot of, a lot of people feel that Tasha. All right, eighty two. All right, bro. Okay. All, right, Gary. All right, thank you guys. Bye. 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 I think a lot of people feel that uh, Tasha did them wrong in the business, and I think a lot of people feel that broken trust when you find out it was a lie. So maybe that's another reason. V, everyone's uh, going in on you in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm tough. I can take it. <laughs> hey, Candy, how are you? I'm doing good. Let me start out with the question: Does she need her channel down? Because people are going in. I I do feel she does. I feel she needs her channel down if she could potentially do this to somebody else. Mm. Mm. And if she oh, hasn't yeah. learned from story. this, the way I feel like she hasn't learned, I feel like she could potentially do this again to somebody else and somebody who may not be as strong as cardi b yeah. or may not have the money like cardi b yeah and you know cyber bullying you know people the the effects of cyber bullying can be very very tragic you know yeah, yeah. and i think honestly i, I kind of agree with v in the sense that um you know cardi b is definitely no angel at all mm -hmm. and she has said like a lot of cruel and hurtful things um, about people and two people, but the only difference between in that situation who is who like, she talked about besides when she hit Nikki upside the head with a shoe. Well, I mean the fact that she bragged <laughs> about that? The, yeah, the fact that she bragged about like you know um, hurting men, like putting men in a in a bad oh, position, okay. unwillingly. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Now yeah. it'd be different. Like say for instance, if Cardi B did that and then she named the men who she did it to and mm. made fun of them and harped on them and stuff, but she didn't she she did it but then she backed away from it whereas i think tasha k it's like she Definitely. went in on went in on um cardi b and never let up and i think the reason why she never let up was because i think tasha k she saw she equated going after cardi b to um making her career go higher so the more she took her down cardi b down the more her career would rise up so I think that's why she was so like into trying to like completely destroy her because she knew that if she was able to do that, then that would put her channel and her her name and everything. It, it, her name would be like w like well known basically. So her her right. success was caught was wrapped up in Cardi B's demise, and I think that's the reason why she was trying to tear her down so badly. Um. Uh, uh Miss Green says, I don't agree with not using the N-word. We have suffered behind that word and found a way to remove the power from it. If if you have been dis degraded as a black person, I don't care what rap song you hear. You can't use it. That's what's that's starting to be my new. That's what I agree with too. Thank you, Candy, for calling in. I appreciate the call. Yeah, thanks, Candy. Yeah, thanks, Candy. All right, you're welcome. Thank you. Take care. <laughs> Um, I'm really backed up. I'm sorry, bringing in more people. Hi, Autumn. Hi, uh, D Free. Let's start with you, Autumn. What are your thoughts on this? I agree with Diva. Diva, you're 100% right, in my opinion. You can't go out here and maliciously try to, not try to, you maliciously attack someone. You lied and you admitted to lying and you knew it was a lie. So now, you can't do that job no more. I don't care where you go work. Run your studio, have other people come in and find other ways to do whatever. Do now, you want you, her gone completely? Absolutely. absolutely. If, you, if, you, if you were a subscriber, you don't have to say if you're a subscriber or not. If you were a subscriber, would you want to unsubscribe to her because of this? I did back when it was going on. I used to be a subscriber of hers, but when all of this was going on, I said, no, this is too messy. This is nasty. I don't want to be a part of it. So not only did I unsubscribe, but I stopped watching, you know, so 
I, I can't just tune in every day and pretend like you're not defaming somebody. And these things can literally would have Cardi B would have taken um, the measures that she said she may have felt like she was led to do. Then we'd be mm-hmm. sitting here um, with a whole different story, right? The same thing with you guys have mentioned John Gates. He's irresponsible on his channel. That needs to come down. That needs um, to come down. I um, agree with you Jenny, on that one. Sorry. <laughs> Jenny, um, Jenny from Bravo, she did something wrong in her job. She needed to get fired. You do something wrong, you get fired. You don't yeah. just keep get um, another chance to come back to work. You need to find another job because you're not good at this one. That yeah. part. Yeah. <laughs> right. Come on now. What do you have to say, D? <laughs> what do you have to say? Oh, she hung up. You took it down. Trav, uh oh, oh, no, I don't. What you very say? I'm gonna make mine quick. You know what? Tasha K been a known liar. Mm. She been a known liar since she came in her mama's womb or her. <laughs> oh lord! <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? You know all the way back. Since her mama's womb, she been lying. <laughs> Yeah, she been, she's been an own liar ever since <laughs> she's been castrated. Uh, okay, what, so what they do the dog neuter her? Oh, you want to neuter her? Oh, Trav. <laughs> well, I don't know what she is, but a liar, and she losing all this money, and that's what she deserves, and her <laughs> husband too. Y'all know I'm gonna come correct when I come up here, <laughs> but you know what? <laughs> What do you think? Fuck John Young too. I know it ain't about him, but because I want him to dock me, and I want somebody to knock on my door. <laughs> okay, so you, so you think the channel should come down too? I want it all. I want London Bridge to not fall down. <laughs> oh, I want it to down on, in the We want London Bridge to fall. <laughs> Trav. Now you acting like V saying you are getting a pleasure out of somebody's downfall, right? Hold up, hold up. No, pleasure gonna be since I ain't got a girlfriend right now. Pleasure gonna be when I lay down, and then that's gonna be pleasure. I don't give a fuck about them and they downfall. <laughs> okay, Trav. In, in your eyes, what can Tasha K do to redeem herself? Slit her wrist. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, oh, no, no, we can't say that. Oh, no, no. You went a little too far. You went a little too far. Well, y'all asked the wrong person. Yeah. Okay, well, know. guess what? I didn't know. I didn't know. <laughs> guess what? I love y'all. Bye. I'm getting out. I'm going to be in the bush. Oh, Lord. Bye, Trav. Bye. But he, a lot of people are really upset with her. Not that but just because we won her channel down does not mean that we're relishing in her downfall. I think this whole thing is sad. It's right. really, really sad. And it did not have to um happen. How stupid do are you? Like it doesn't I, I don't I don't understand. Um, welcome to the channel. Sorry, uh Heart of Inspiration. Why is Tasha still talking trash on Twitter? Because she's a narcissist. She can't help it at this point. There, There's nothing else that she can do. She's got to try to make this seem like this is hurtful. You can't. She broke down in the courtroom crying yesterday, according to eyewitnesses. So this is hurtful for her. So she's got to try to, you know, put the bravado on. But what do you mean by put the bravado on? What 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 is she doing? She don't you think she's got to act like this is not going to face her. You're saying she's acting like this doesn't phase her when it is phasing her. And if she would let us see that it's phasing her, then we would think differently, wouldn't we? Perhaps. But Maybe she you don't reap want what you, you sow. This is the thing. You reap what you sow. And she has sown a lot of bad seed. And that does not to say that Cardi's a saint, but Cardi was not. This was not Tasha versus Cardi. This was Cardi versus Tasha. And this is just a bad history. Mm. She's been, you know, this is a woman that will tell everybody, yeah, I put out lies and people still watch it. So she's, she displays a lot of narcissistic tendencies. And unfortunately, I don't know, it could be getting to her or it could actually just not be getting to her. Like she just, it's not, I don't know. 
but it's she's not going to take that down until the judge gives the injunction, and that's not for at least another. You don't 30 think days. she's going to take it down? Like no, 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 she won't. Crazy. But she hasn't done it so far. The minute I would have stepped foot in that trial for that court case, Sherelle, them videos would have been down. I, I would have been so humble to that judge. Mm -hmm. I would have been like, look, the videos are down. I made a mistake. Matter of fact, they deleted off my channel. I can't never re-upload them or whatever again. I don't got them nowhere. I would have been like, they're destroyed. They're gone. I don't know where they at, but I took them down. Now, if somebody else already has a copy or recorded it, I can't control that, but they are off my channel. So I wouldn't still have those videos up. You got to show some type of remorse. You got to show something. So even, Sherelle, if you think you're wrong sometimes and you know the other person is hurt, you can humble yourself and say, yeah. you know what? I don't feel like I was wrong, but if you're hurt, I apologize and I will stop and I will take it down. Let me ask this question a question really quick. Uh, I want to read this to you. Hi, Diva. I hope you didn't find my comments disrespectful last night. I only meant to that uh, YouTube will be fine considering Cardi has more subs than Tasha. And then there's a part two. <laughs> and I actually meant to reply to V, not you. Sorry for the mix up. You <laughs> ladies are amazing. Um, inspiration. Did I get told off or something? I don't even know. You're having a rough day today, V, but you said you can handle it. Uh, okay. I can handle it. What should happen to the channel? Because people are really going for her channel now. Well, first of all, it's not anybody's choice except for YouTube. The judge cannot order YouTube to take it down. I don't believe. I believe the only thing that they can do, which will be over the next, in 30 days, there will be the injunction hearing. Right. And that's when he'll say what she can and cannot do and what happens to these videos. The channel itself, as much as I feel like that channel along with other channels should be taken down. Let's just be real. We still have a first amendment. Yeah. As long as she's able to use it responsibly, I can't stop just like we can't stop the national Enquirer or the sun or the mirror from right. existing. Exactly. She should still have, you know, she still should have the channel and she's got a big bill to pay. And she, I don't think she make that much money. And the IRS was in the court too. So she got a lot going on over there. She's going to need that yeah. channel, the Patreon, the website, the app. She's going to need a whole lot because yeah. this is a long, this is a long haul for her. This ain't going to, this, this ain't no chump change. I mean, I don't have $3.8 million. I, mean, you I don't either. either. Yeah. Don't have no Listen, but here's the thing though, right? Is she was that willing to do whatever for clicks and views when she didn't need the cash? What will she do now that she needs it? Mm. What will she say? Mm. So my thing is, are you is she really going to stay there and be responsible and humble and just tell stories that are 100 percent accurate or that she verified? But now knowing that you need to pay a four million dollar bill, bill, what links will you go to? to get a story, tell a story, and tell the story incorrectly so that you can pay off this bill. It's going Diva, up for her private Diva, do you really think she going to go back to court again over lying on a... On a she video? won't take the videos down. The video is still up. <laughs> yeah, but that's, 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 that's right true. Now. She paid that's $4 million dollars for them videos. I'm talking about you think she going to do it again? Let's, let's give, let's give it over. Uh, let's give. Hey, V, v let, me, let, me, let me answer that question. I can't say if she would or not, but I've known people personally that robbed the same bank twice in a week. <laughs> so I'm saying it's possible. Really, That's Gary? Hard. Come on now. <laughs> Tasha, was, Tasha was delusional for um, some reason. She didn't realize that this could have impacted her pockets as much as it has. Yeah, Back in yeah. October of 2021, she posted on her page, someone said, must have told her she was going to have to pay $3 million. Her post said something like, oh, y'all are crazy. I'm not going to have to pay $3 million. All I'm going to have to do, if anything, is give her a measly seventy-five k plus. I remember she, that. Yeah. yeah. She didn't realize how much the plus was. Right. <laughs> and she, she didn't, I don't think she understood the ramifications of what she could have had to pay. Certainly mm -hmm. not 3.8 million. But I'm going to say this, this might be unpopular. 
Uh, I was concerned that Cardi, I did not know for sure Cardi was going to win this case because defamation cases against a celebrity are very, very, very right. difficult right. to win. Mm -hmm. The reason why, in my opinion, one of the reasons why she lost is because you cannot sit on the stand and right. say under oath, yeah. yeah, I did this out of malice. Absolutely. Yeah. Like, yeah. You, you can't do that. And there was other defenses that her defense team could have used. Yeah, it, it, they could have used like uh, it was a reasonable. I had a reasonable reason to think this. There's some legal term for it. I'm not a lawyer. I just play one on TV. So <laughs> I, you know, but so there were Let, other let's defense. Talk, let, inspiration. Let's talk about her attorneys. What was that? They were terrible. They but really the, were. But they. Well, okay, that they, tells you the resources or finances she got, right? Ooh. Another reason ooh. why she shouldn't have did this. Well. Listen, mm -hmm. they're criminal attorneys, though, guys. They're not defamation right, court right, attorney, ca right. case attorneys. And if you, I cannot see Tasha K taking somebody's advice over what she feels. Is, she really felt she was right in everything she said. So if you have a difficult client, your attorney, if you're not going to listen to your attorney, that attorney is going to do what you ask them to do because they're going to get paid anyway. Yeah, oh, let's be honest. Their money. Tasha right. K is not the the smartest one out there. She even admitted that she repeated yeah. the ninth grade three times, and now what? we know why. Stop! Yes. I didn't hear that part. Yeah. No, she said it. She says it all the time that you know I'm yeah. not that smart. I repeated the ninth grade three times. I thought she was joking, but is now it is it a joke? Is she no, serious? It's not a joke. She's, I heard her with my own ears. That she said. But I thought she was joking when she was saying it. But now I think she was telling the truth. Wow. So I don't think she understood everything. And I and <laughs> honestly, if I was going to, until this trial really started, actually until the, 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 the medical records came back with the negative test, um, until that happened, I really honestly still believed that Tasha had a chance to beat this because the bar is extremely high to prove defamation when you're a celebrity at the level of, of, of a Cardi B. Right. So that goes to show you how that goes to show you how egregious her actions were. Yeah. And that's why her channel needs to come down. Mm. All right, you guys, thank you for calling. Yeah. I'm gonna take some more thank calls. You. Uh, Thanks, ladies. Thanks, guys. You guys have a good night. You too. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Take care. This is just wow. Hey, uh, Corey. Oh, my gosh. Ah, Corey, you can come with that bag. <laughs> can you hear us, Corey? Hey, Corey. Yeah, I can hey, hear you. Everybody. Can you hear me? Yeah. You sound off first because this is a lot. And before you sound off, I need to. I'm not trying to get you going, but she's still talking trash on her social media. <laughs> What's your thoughts on that? And the, and the videos are still up. What's your thoughts on that? Talking to me or, or I'm, I'm talking to you, Corey. I'm talking to you. Okay. I was on MIMS this morning and uh -huh. said that those videos are making more money than they did in the first Post. You are fading oh, in and out. Corey is bad today. Oh, you get a bad yeah. signal, Corey. You get a bad signal or something. Go on mute and try to fix it. Okay. And I'll move over to you. Uh, what's your name? Uh, Nikki? Nikia. Nikia. Uh, wh what, you answer the question. The video's still up and she's still talking trash. What, what do you think about that? I think it's horrible. I mean, I'm a woman, specifically a black woman. So mm. I feel like as a black woman, we should be holding her to the highest standard at this point. She has not only violated herself and her family and her channel, I feel like she violated us as black women, especially in the sense that we're trying to take in the, the climate that we're in today. So I think it's horrible. And if nothing else, we should be banding together to get that off of the air. Do you think her channel should be taken down? Absolutely, absolutely. How do you right the wrong if the channel's gone? Well, she might have to do with all the other actors and actresses do. You know, she's taking some time off to think and work on her. Only fans? <laughs> <Sure. Yeah. laughs> that what you're, that's what they do. Well, <laughs> OnlyFans take her because right. she lies a lot. So would there be her videos that she put up on OnlyFans? It's a question. Yeah. 
So. I don't know why the video is still up. Canelo, uh, please gently state your case. Y'all know, know how you I don't feel like about her. her. Y'all know how I feel about it. Y'all know I was bullied by her. Yeah. Possibly my channel was snatched down by her and the winos two years ago while mm. all this stuff was going on. So mm. I have no sympathy. So the channel should come down. And for everybody who keeps saying that Tasha, I mean, that Cardi B is, you know, this woman who's using race as a card. Why don't y'all go over there and look at Tasha K's videos while they're still up before they get taken down and find out that she's been calling black people, not just the I in, you know, I know in I G G A, but the heart in um, G G E R, not once, not twice, but every video and telling everybody that the black people are not, you know, she doesn't like black people. Black people haven't done anything for her, but why y'all support her and she's saying this to y'all. Remember, Cardi is helping people up there. And I'm not saying she's an angel. I'm not saying she's this God we should put on a pedestal. But compared to what Cardi B has done, what has Tasha done for anybody besides stealing their money when they uh, the hurricane victims <laughs> was asking her what happened to their money? And she looking at y'all laughing while she's sipping tea and telling y'all it ain't none of your effing business. But y'all still go there and watch her. Well, well I need you to d talk to V directly. <laughs> v, <laughs> because... knows how, v knows how I, <laughs> she knows how I, I can't stand I see her. his nostrils <laughs> spread wide. I ain't <laughs> <laughs> V knows how I cannot stand him. V knows by <laughs> And V knows this. So, but my whole thing is, for those of you who are coming in, y'all have no idea. I've been following Tasha K in this whole situation since 2017. My first video on her, the lies that she told about the Mimi, no, was it um, Kirk and Rashida versus Jasmine situation about oh, the baby. Oh, wow, you went way back. This was, my first video was called The Lies of a Drunk Blogger. So this should have told y'all right then that she was lying. I had, bar, I mean, I was stars. I had the Widows coming after me then. And then on the uh, pajama party. So wait, she, so wait. You're saying if you don't like her, her Widows will come after you? Yes. Is that yes. Mm. They was tearing me down in my comment section. <laughs> and, my, and, and my channel was that big. V, were you was, over there? <laughs> that was before my time. <laughs> I, and my, I had, my first channel was not B. So I was getting torn down. So this channel that I'm on now was at the um, pajama party. And that's when me and Tasha had got kind of got into it. But before I got the chance to say my piece, Lovely T came out and stated the case and drug her behind. So after that, the day after that, I get, you know, drugged in the B sector by, you know, Olivia the Oracle. I so let me let me state this so everyone knows. You used to be Lovely T's moderator. You are I'm still, a mod I'm still one. I'm still okay, one. you're mo Lovely T's moderator. What do you think the purpose was, was dragging that tape into court? I don't get that. Because, okay, that night on the, um, the night on the pajama party, she had told Lovely T she was going to expose that tape. The recording, because that's when I think Lovely T really figured out that she was recorded. She said she was going to uh, expose the whole plan that, you know, they were supposed to trim the internet. And she released it and it told everything that Lovely T was saying was true, that she had nothing to do with it. But I'm like, Tasha, why would you be so stupid to put this out and it doesn't back up anything you're saying? Are you saying that Tasha K is calculating? Because you keep saying Lovely T didn't know she was recorded. That she wasn't, she didn't know she was recorded at that time when it was being recorded. But Tasha told us that she had the recording at the pajama party. It's still up online as a Judas channel. You, it's an eight hour, it's an eight hour live. She said this, I will put it out, and she said, put it out. It's just gonna make you look crazier than what you are. And she said that to Lovely T. Yes. Child. yes, Corey, can you hear us now? Yeah, can you hear me now? Oh, Wait, yeah. better. 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 Okay, yeah. I had to get on my phone. Okay. Camilo is 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 pressed. Okay, he's in his feelings. He do not like <laughs> Tasha K. <laughs> oh my love! I've been going through it as long as I have, and you know, and being bullied, but not as on to the extent as Lovely T, Cardi B. Cardi B has been drunk by this woman for three years. Now I'm not like I said, I'm not taking up for Cardi saying she's a saint. But if she asks you three times to take them down, but you leave them up and they're still up and she's not using her channel to empower black people, she's tearing black people down. 
She's bullying people. So why should he stay up? I don't care how she make that money. I don't care if it gets taken down today and she's out here on the side of the street after for a quarter. That's what she needs to do, and that's how I feel. So she can miss me with the yeah. bullshit. So okay, okay. <laughs> can I say this real quick? Because everybody Wait, go, you're right, think about it, V. Can you only plan with you? Everybody already be please. So, I, I can say what I'm on here if I already mad. But anyway, okay. uh, if you were in a fight with somebody, do you really expect her to take the video down when you're fighting? Okay, V. Explain. You know uh, okay. All right. See, I'll be praying for you, V. 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 Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Hey, you uh, know what? V. 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 Let me answer that question for you. You said if I was in a fight, would I take him down? Yeah. If I got that uh, charge of 3.8, or if that guy would have hit me in my eye hard enough, I would have stopped. I would have took no, him I'm down. About after the fact, I'm talking about why they were. No, 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 no. While he was fighting, I'm swinging, yeah. he's swinging, he hit me in my eye hard enough. I'm taking the videos down. Yeah. What if that was a man? Like, put into context, what if that was a man's channel who did that to Cardi B and the same, the same instances were in place? You would be mad. You would mm -hmm. want that to be taken. And we're not calling it what it actually is, it's professional rape. That she has the ability Ooh, to the make hour. money off of Cardi's body. She's having the ability to make money in the future off of Cardi's body. So if that was a man sitting in that chair, we would be talking totally different. The well, hold on, hold on, Nakia. Are you related to uh, Layla Lynn? No. You look just like her, though. No. You do. I'm, I'm looking. I'm like, is Layla Lynn's sister or something? <laughs> <laughs> Has anybody told you you talk just like her? No, never the first time. Oh, okay. <laughs> anyway, what were you saying? Because I got caught up in the Layla Lynn thing. You're saying... <laughs> it's professional rape. I mean, realistically, she's profiting off of somebody else's body that she was just got a judgment on, and she refuses to take it down. She's using her platform, her stature. Don't say the R word. Say R word. Yeah, the R word. The R word. Yeah. Excuse me. And YouTube is allowing her to continue to profit. So, again, I feel like Tasha channel should come down. It's doing more hurt than it is help in the blogger's atmosphere because she's setting it up for precedence on the federal level when you take it to the state and county level for someone coming after you. Got that me. part right there. That part right there. Corey, I haven't given you a chance to speak. You have mic problems. Now you are good to go. What do you have okay. to say? Okay. Um, I agree with um, young lady that just spoke. Let's call her um, Layla too. Layla too. <laughs> Layla Jr. <laughs> um, but I've been saying this all week that it's setting a bad precedence for creators of color and black creators. This is setting a bad precedence. And it's going to fall back on all of you all, which I think is totally wrong because it takes only one of us to mess up. And you know they only give us that one time to mess up. And then yeah. they're going to drag us through the mud religiously because of it and i just think and she's still making money off of cardi she's mm -hmm. still making money though i was on mims this morning i was saying before i had mic trouble and he's saying that they're worth yeah, more trouble. now than they were when she first put them up she's making more yeah, yeah. Did i see first that put them yeah. up. and see and that makes no sense because this is three years worth of videos that hurt cardi Oh, and, yes. you know, and it's making it, and like I said, it's not being used for good, it's being used for bullying. And mm -hmm. the more that people go watch that, the more this is going to go on. So how is it, like what Diva said, if she owes this money now, and, you know, what would she do to continue to try to make this money? And, you know, th that she got to pay court. I mean, I'm saying Corey. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> she got to pay, <laughs> she gotta pay she gotta Corey. Corey. So it's like, so you're going to continue to use this channel to bully Cardi even more when you just um, got a four million dollar um, judgment against you to continue to harass this woman to make money to pay the woman. I mean, how this makes no sense. Tasha, Tasha, if you're listening, please take the videos do down. Don't waste your breath. She is. She's not. not. Well, it's going to come down in thirty days, right? Yeah. You don't get three yeah. counts of being liable for the situation, and then they're going to allow the videos to stay up. Yeah. So the videos are going to eventually come down. But the sad yeah. part is 
you would do yourself a better service if you just said, hey, I took them down. Yeah. You yeah. would look a little bit better, like you're learning yeah. some lessons and like you get the magnitude of this particular situation. Yeah. It's yeah. out of control at this point. And all you're saying, you can tell no lessons are learned because all you're saying is you're going to appeal. You still wasting all of this money and your family's time in the yeah. energy. You are losing so much more by trying to win the case. You know that saying, they say you're cutting off your own nose despite your face. your face. Why are you doing this? Like, let it go. It done went down. It didn't go in your favor. But you're trying to prove to your one million followers that you just, the, you know what, and that you got this and you're going to make it happen. Boo boo, it's over. You mm -hmm. look the whole thing in for the by tomorrow. That's what she huh? needs to do. Oh, I, I don't think a, they'll get a divorce. Camilo don't. don't. So. I don't think they're going to get a divorce. I just don't. Well, Camilo, okay, Camilo, 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 it was it was bad strategy given to her by bad attorneys who are criminal attorneys and not civil attorneys. See, her problem is she went to she hired the wrong lawyers. True. She that could have those lawyers did not help. It did. It did they, not help. No, she could in turn sue the lawyers. Now listen, tomorrow she's going live. We be there, Camilo? Oh, I already did a video on it. Trust me, I'm gonna be there with my popcorn because I'm gonna tell you. She remember I told y'all, Cardi said when she did that lot before she sued um, Tasha that that channel would be hers. Mm. I want to see what she Cardi got to say B. Before. Cardi B said that remember, Tasha K's channel will be hers. Remember when she sat in the bathroom with that towel on her head? On yes, Instagram, she did. She said, "I'm gonna sue that bitch." And her channel will be mine. Yes, she did. did. So when I'm sitting over there looking at her with my popcorn and my Pepsi, watching that channel <laughs> calm down. That's too much detail. Was there <laughs> ice in the Pepsi at least? I sure am. <laughs> v, V, V. What, 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 what? Like Cardi B is on a mission. Uh, you might as well just go, you know. I can't. <laughs> Be your girl in danger. Be <laughs> girl, you in danger. I, 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 I walk that kind of line every day. I ain't scared. Be you, my girl. I told you, when I say I'm tough, I'm tough. I'm tough. So uh, I can't go nothing back me down. <laughs> Brendan wants to say something real quick. Is that go okay, ahead, Brendan? First of all. This child hasn't learned yet. I mean, they say God <laughs> except they're both kids and idiots. Guess which one she is? Second, oh, those lawyers need to be sued, disbarred, and brought up on charges. Second, I thought the most painful thing I've ever saw was Friday after next. Was don't, don't say that. <laughs> Enough. You can't go too far. I'm glad he brought this up. Remember now, everybody been saying that how Tasha does talk saying. about every uh, how Cardi B's been talking about everybody. Remember how Tasha got up there and talked about was it Genuine's Wine's baby? <gasps> um, with the whole um, okay, Camila, you is going I, way look, back. Look, Camila, me, I'm telling you, know, now, can, 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 can Tasha ever no. uh, what, can, what can Tasha do to give your forgiveness? Because this is going into years, <laughs> you need to let it go. He need therapy. He oh, need therapy. <laughs> <laughs> what does your therapist say about this, Canelo? You know, what's your therapist say? Like, that ain't nothing she can do but lose that channel for me to feel good. Because to lose the channel and then you let because, it go? Because it's not being used for good. It's Absolutely. Being what is somebody committed? I mean, if y'all have been on, if y'all have not been on the attack, Lionel is a Jew, the lovely T. Uh, Camille's corner, myself, and no, other no, small. I don't people. mean to stop you, Camille. That was three years ago. No, mine was. Well, yeah, it was three years ago. No, <laughs> I knew you had a real I knew you had a real I could at. tell. But still, it's, but the challenge. Hey, I mean, the videos are still up. No, Sherelle, Sherelle, up there. that's it. We are going to collect the funds and we're going to sponsor Camille and send him to therapy. <laughs> yeah, because baby, you got to relax. You got to let it go. The energy is still there. The energy is high. The energy is high. You got to release it. Right, let, release me it. Take, let me take in another group. Camille, don't okay. hang up because I need to talk to you backstage. <laughs> yeah, he needs to relax. <laughs> 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 
Can, 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 can you help me? Can you help me? Love y'all. Someone else to take to change his uh, temperature in a different direction. Go take a laxative, Canelo. <laughs> 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 right, I ain't going to look like Okay, one more. Be crazy. Oh, everyone hung up. All right. All right, so we're going to go ahead and wrap this up. I understand Canelo's pain. I'm joking with them, but when somebody yeah. do you wrong, you don't forget. It it hurts. Hurts. Right. Yeah, that you understand, me. When somebody do you wrong, do you wrong. They, oh, you I hold grudges, so I, I definitely understand. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> B, why are you defending Tasha K? Please don't ask that question. We can wrap it up. Uh, <laughs> v, <laughs> we have we, we V is just that's where she stands, and that's it. All mm -hmm. right, guys. Uh, there's more to this case. I will be there tomorrow because I want to see uh her Tasha K's response because I am just flabbergasted that the video's still up. She's still talking trash on Twitter. I give Cardi B speech uh A. She seems sincere and she really could have dragged uh, Tasha and rubbed it in her face that she won, but she was kind of humble about it. I don't know what she's done in her past, V, but for that speech, it was pretty good. Last mm -hmm. words, Perry. Oh, no, I'm good. I mean, I'm good. Diva. Um, I pray that tomorrow night and maybe some of the winos is listening and can get to her and try to tell her this, that when she goes live, she apologizes to Cardi B. She yeah. said, I'm going to take down these videos. She apologizes yeah. to all the followers and all the yeah. people that may have been hurt, that she hurt in the past or whatever. And she also said, listen, I'm going to do better on my channel from this point moving forward. And then say thank you and goodbye because if she talks too long, she's gonna mess up. <laughs> <laughs> v, what are your final words, V? I think that she's gonna learn from this. I think that she should uh, keep her channel, and I think she's gonna learn from this. And y'all gonna see a better Tasha K. Okay, <laughs> all right, and we gonna leave it at that because V, she just V is. She fell and hit her head earlier. She said that she's not changing her opinion. All right. I want to thank everyone for the super chats. Uh, you don't have to support the channel. You do. So I really appreciate that from the bottom of my heart. Chat, don't forget to hit that like button on your way out. If I didn't take your call backstage, I'm so sorry. I am simply out of time. But we will be back tomorrow because Tasha K will be going live and she will be making more money. It is what it is. Everyone's going to be over there. All yep. right, y'all. On three, let's say bye. One, two, three. Bye, guys. Bye.